Uh, Echo 100 Plus is a non-profit organization. We support refugees from the moment they arrive in Greece and we keep supporting them until they manage to integrate. Echo 100 Plus provides refugee integration in Athens and Laros through the hubs, educational and community spaces where refugees can attend language and IT classes, professionalizing workshops and recreational activities like sports or arts and crafts. On Laros, we also distribute clothes through our boutique system. Our idea is that they still keep their dignity, which in their daily life they've lost completely and decide for themselves what they would like to wear. Our biggest strength is our flexibility. That is possible because of the trust and the direct contact with our donors. Because of this flexibility, this year we could expand our programs and respond quickly to the emergencies triggered by COVID-19 while keeping activities at the hubs running. In March, the government decided a national lockdown. Uh, during the lockdown, which was about six weeks, we will continue the activities and the lessons through our international volunteers online. We observed that our students, of course, were very upset because the hub is not only a learning space, it's really a community centre, and so they had no place to go. We posted films, we posted fitness, we basically tried to keep in touch. So imagine being homeless, plus COVID plus being a refugee and people they don't have means of protecting themselves. Because of the effects of the corona crisis in both Laros and Athens, we needed to shift priorities, and funds that normally would go into the hubs were used to organize emergency distributions of COVID protection equipment, hygiene items, clothes, and also food. We uh, fundraised and we provided pasta and rice. So we start organizing a distribution with summer clothes for 1,400 people. During the lockdown, we thought that we support everyone working in the hotspots with protection gear. After that, we gave the hygiene staff to the residents of the town. The refugee crisis on its own, as difficult as it is, is now facing another challenge, the COVID-19 crisis. Because of this, we used a part of our funds to face emergencies, but it is still important that our hubs keep running to give refugees a community space and help them integrate into European society. Today is Giving Tuesday. Please help ECHO keep its hubs alive by donating to our global giving campaign. Thank you for your support.